Control airing one, I am in position to enter to the first class gangway door. Standing by. Herring one, go ahead and thrust forth into the vestibule. We see that one of the vestibule doors is closed. See if you can jar it loose with your nose cone. Now be advised that your nose cone can withstand up to 10,000 pounds per square inch of additional pressure. We recommend that you do not exceed 10,000 psi. Over. Roger that. Thrusting forth. Roger, Harry One. Applying 1,000 psi. Okay, continue. It'll take at least 5,000. Over. Three thousand psi. No movement. All right. Uh, continue, Harry One. Five thousand psi. Eight thousand. Ten thousand. Still no movement. Herring 1, proceed to 12,000 PSI. Over. Okay. May I remind you that while submerged, each pilot can, may override the decision made by the chief mission scientist if he or she feels like they are at risk. That's affirmative, Ployas. It's your call. Over. Applying 12,000 PSI. Cloyus, no! She's not letting you in, man! Don't force her! The door is giving way. I repeat, I have motion. Yeah! Roger that, Harry One. Well, well done. If you don't abort the dive, I will. What? Your commander just exceeded the 2K3 active line limit. A senior pilot had authority to abort the dive for safety inspection. Enhance your calm, Lieutenant. This mission is far too important for me to allow you to jeopardize us. Herring one, report. How does she look from the inside? Like Carl's Bad Caverns. With a few exceptions. Herring 2, you are a go to descend into the stairwell. Roger, taking on ballast for descent. Herring 3, you are a go for interior ops. Ten four control dropping down into cargo hatch one. Dead. Watch a kill cam for obstructions. And down six floors down to the Orlop deck. Don't exceed two knots. Over. Heading down the stairwell. Looks like the entire Grande stairway floated away during the sinking. Val, be careful. Don't pitch down too far. Or you'll descend right into those steel foundation girders.
Whoa! Okay, Cloyus, what's your 20? At the base of the stairwell, four decks below you. It's stalling. The computer is initiating. Bravo, Sierra? Bravo, Sierra? It's blindsided. That makes one brain on the lights. What? Do it! The Herring One, tilt your lights up. Over. Herring One, acknowledge. I have control reacquiring buoyancy. Copy that, Herring Two. How did you know that? Well, I've had a bit of time lately to catch up on my reading, haven't I? Hey, Val, just drop it in. No, I thought I'd stay a while. Head back up to ADAC and resume your checklist. Yes, sir. Hey, Dad, did you, uh, did you reach the Orlop deck yet? Sky blue, sea of green, in our yellow submarine. Yo, Dedge, you there? Bingo! Hey guys, I got it. I think I found it. Herring 3, please respond. Over. Hello? Guys? Val, can you hear me? Val, maintain position. I'm going to check out on Dej. We have, we have loss of signal. Lois, did you try to reacquire the high game? I've got nothing. Uh, comms are down. Are we not reading them at all? All I've got is their telemetry locators. Uh, Herring 1 is nominal. He's ascending up the stairwell. Herring 2, nominal. She's in the stairwell at sea deck level. Herring 3, nominal. He's at the Orlock deck. Herring 4, Herring 4 is also at the Orlop deck. This can't be right. It says his defense system is armed. Sky of blue, sea of green. Background check on this guy, right? Pardon me? Harry Ford, background check! Yeah, Taurus Culver. Ammunitions technician at Plastec Fiberworks. He incorporated the defense system to the 2K3X design. Well, I'll bet Dallas and Donut that's not his real name. Do a fiber op scan of his photo and confirm identification. Alright, I'm, I'm on it. Give me five minutes. 